Okay, so it's not every day you get to be behind the scenes of a fighter pilot's launches, routines, and recovery. This is already making me feel a little dizzy. <laughs> ABC 4's Jordan Verdadero got the opportunity today to witness the F-35 demonstration at the Hill Air Force Base. Taking off at over 150 miles per hour in a fighter jet is normal for Air Force Captain Kristen Wolf. It wasn't a dream of mine when I was a little kid, but I kind of grew into it. Uh, and honestly grew to love it. A newly certified pilot, Captain Wolf is the first female pilot for the F-35A demonstration team. And this is the first year the team is at Hill Air Force Base. First time I actually remember seeing a woman fly was at Tuscaloosa, Alabama when I saw the Blue Angels come. The practice is for the team's first appearance at the Yuma Air Show that will take place at the Marine Corps Air Station in Yuma, Arizona. The coolest part is to know that you're the only one out there going to do the demo and to show people on the ground like what a little bit of what this jet is capable of. The jets are combat ready. Wolf wears a G suit to keep her safe. Basically, when we start pulling G's and the gravity uh, pulls the blood down towards our feet, we want to try to keep it up in the brain. So this suit gives about one and a half to two G's of protection. It inflates with air as we start to pull G's and pushes all that blood back up into the brain. If you want to see what the U.S. Air Force has to offer, and it's up to 600 mile per hour fighter jets, the F-35 demo team will be hosting a show this June.